Well, Dr. Earl, thank you for joining us today. And uh, thank you for being part of Actives. We're excited to have you part of the team. It's great to be here. Well, it's funny you should use the word link. I know I didn't coach you for that. Uh, but in, in regards to the product that we're introducing called Link, um, we're pretty excited about this connection between different systems. And can you tell us a little bit about the connectivity between the brain and, and the gut, or what some people call the second brain? The gut is the key to health. And the reason is because, first, it's responsible for digesting our nutrients, the vitamins, the minerals, all those key components that we need in order to, for us to maintain health. The second is that it is very integrated with our immune system. Estimates, and I shouldn't say estimates, depending upon your degree of illness, if you will, and inflammation, 70 to 80 percent of, of your immune system actually resides in and around the digestive system. So huge. And, and ultimately, the other component is the nerves. They actually, there's actually enough nerve tissue around the gut, around the digestive system, that they call it a second brain. And interestingly enough, 95, 90 to 95% of neurotransmitters are actually made in and around the digestive system, even that your brain uses. Well, we hear a lot about gut health and the importance of gut health. There's things that are prebiotics, probiotics. There's a, there's a lot of noise out there about what people should be doing for their gut health and to reestablish or strengthen this connection between the brain and, and the second brain or the gut and sometimes called the microbiome. What do you think is uh, the crucial difference with our product called Link and other things that are out there? Well, we often talk about Western medicine and the fact that it's often treating the leaves on the tree and not the, not the true root cause. We know through basic gardening or if you've done anything with plants that if you'll get something into the root system, if you'll actually introduce it into the soil and let the roots take it up, you affect the entire organism. And that's what we really find with, with Link is the fact that it really gets deep into the body, into the system. It, it's a cre crucial link, actually, between your microbiome, the bacteria that live in your gut, your digestive system, and then ultimately your nervous system. Um, it's connected in so many different ways, and it really is foundational to true health. As I've researched our active ingredients, uh, butyric acid and other uh, very important ingredients that are part of Link, I've been overwhelmed by the amount of research and the number of benefits that um, supplementing with this very unique proprietary um, active ingredient can have. But if you were to talk about, oh, the top three or four benefits uh, that people could expect, you're the doctor, what would you say are the top benefits? Well, I think keep in mind some very important things. We're tying inflammation to so many different diseases, uh, be that cardiovascular disease, hypertension, strokes, um, the list goes on and on and on. So Link has a crucial role to play in decreasing overall systemic inflammation. Um, the other thing is we've talked about foundational things. Let me back up just a little bit here if I may and sure. say as a doctor if I can find a product or a system or a series of products that really affects the body and the tissues so foundationally that it makes such a big difference throughout the entire system I get excited about that. I really do. And, and so that's what we find, find with Link. Everything from altering your DNA and the way that it is, it is expressed, improving your infl inflammation. Understand, inflammation is a normal part of your body's system. It's just when it gets out of balance and out of sorts that it becomes a problem. Well, butyric acid helps with that. Again, we've talked about DNA. The other key component, mitochondria. These are the powerhouses of your body. They're what ener energize your, your cells and ultimately you. And so butyric acid has an amazing effect on upregulating mitochondria and then making sure that they work correctly in regards to utilizing glucose and oxygen. So it's a very profound effect that it has on the entire system. So going off that for a second, in terms of uh, the mitochondria, does that affect metabolism and such things as, as weight loss, energy levels, all of those things? Yeah, they did a study that actually revealed that patients who did nothing more than just take butyric acid had better utilization of their glucose, their mitochondria increased, they lost on an average of 10% of their body weight, and um, overall improved their energy and sense of well-being significantly.
So you mentioned some uh, neurotransmitters like dopamine and serotonin. Typically, we think of those as being very important for mood, for our ability to sleep, and do things like that. Are you telling me that that actually starts in the gut, and that if we take care of our gut and increase the health of the microbiome, we're, we're, we're affecting our brain health, our mood, and, and other problems like that? Yes, and the answer to that is absolutely. Not just yes, absolutely. It's a critical component, and it's a critical link that has made, been made by science in just the last little bit. And it's drawing that connection and making that connection complete and whole that really empowers overall health. So you mentioned brain fog. I know there's been a lot of, of debate over the years as to whether uh, after a certain age, new brain cells can be developed. If, can they? And if so, what is butyric acid's role in that, if any? Well, first, <clears throat> we've, we've heard that your body can't develop new cartilage. It can't repair your joints. And we, again, cut those out or drug until you have to get them cut out. And we're finding through just some very basic vitamin, mineral, and nutrient injections, oxygen injections, we can actually kickstart that healing process again. We've heard the same thing about our brains, that um, you know the brains won't necessarily regrow or won't remap or whatever. And yet there's this entire branch of neurology called neuroplasticity where they prove that that's the case, that our brain is ever changing, that it can adapt, that it can continue to, to grow even after a certain time frame. So the question is, why won't it? And again, if you look foundationally, the information that put our brains together, our DNA, where did it go? It's still there. So again, why aren't we tapping into that? Why aren't we utilizing that? And certainly there's bigger brains than mine that will say this and that, and, and we're not having certain components. But the reality is we see with neuroplasticity the amazing things that the brain can do. And so if you fuel the brain, if you give the brain the things that it needs, be that the vitamins, minerals, building blocks and so forth. If you protect the brain, so blocking the blood-brain barrier and making it so that the brain can heal and work in confinement, if you get rid of infections, if you relieve toxins, if you get those, those blocks, if you will, to the brain healing, then now we can start to explore some of the possibilities. Uh, pulse electrical magnetic fields, a lot of different components that we're looking at that will help stimulate brain growth and brain activity. But again, foundationally, you've got to create that link. You've got to have a healthy balance of nutrients, vitamins, minerals, and um, neurotransmitters, which all starts in the digestive system. Okay, doctor, um, we've talked a lot about different functions, different systems. Um, now, this may seem a little bit out there, and so if there's no connection, I get it. I've already been amazed at how many things are connected. But does butyric acid have any uh, relationship to the health of the skin? We found that um, often by affecting the digestive system, we can cure rashes, things like psoriasis and a bunch of other things that patients think, oh, that's just a skin disease and they'll take some, some pharmaceuticals to try to help with that when actually the problem is back in the digestive system. Wow, that's amazing. But when you put it that way, it really does make a lot of sense. It, it produces um, endothelial cells that protect the stomach lining, or that, that is the stomach lining that protects us. Yes. It, it uh, protects and strengthens the blood-brain barrier. So I guess it makes sense that it would also protect and benefit the biggest barrier, the biggest organ on our body, which is our skin. All of those seem, things seem to be connected, like you mentioned. Very much connected. And, and, and the, the immune system of the skin seems to be connected to the overall immune system, and so the same food, if you will, that would help one would seem to help the other. This is just amazing stuff, Doc. Um, maybe you can tell us a little bit about what attracted you to, to Link. Wow, great question. So the, the biggest things that I look at is it from a pure source, is it something that really benefits the body? And then we have to be able to not only, if it's a supplement, we have to get it past the digestive, past the stomach and its acid into the digest, digestive system and then absorbed. So I love the fact that again, butyric acid has so many different uses within the body, but a lot of different other pre different preparations won't necessarily get past the stomach, the acid that is there. So 
through fancy biochemistry and science, they've actually taken and wrapped this not only in a product that, or a, a process that gets it past the stomach, but get it, gets it into the digestive system. Well, imagine if that wrapping, if you will, was also utilized and a prebiotic, if you will, food for the rest of your bacteria, your mi microbiome. Well, that's the way they've done. And so you have a product that is really great on, on both spectrums as far as getting past the digestive system, useful to your body, and then it's used by the microbiome. Interestingly enough, some of those fibers, inulin and some of the other fibers that are with Link, are actually used by the digestive system to make additional butyric acid and other components that our body needs. So from a foundational level, from just a overall effectiveness, you're going to get better levels of butyric acid into your body using the link product. But if you were to just close our, our discussion today with, with a few words as to why are you so excited about the potential um, and the benefits that people can expect with, with Link? Well, I think just being one of those foundational treatments, bacteria, if you will, that aren't even connected to our bodies find and you use this and do it in a healthy manner. Butyric acid is one of those things that it, it changes the way we express our DNA, our inflammation, that helps with cardiovascular, it helps with neurofunction, it helps us get rid of chronic infections. Uh, it's just a foundational treatment that's it's, it's extremely exciting. And we combine that with nutrients and so forth that really draw that connection between the gut and the brain, the brain and the immune system, the brain and our hormones. I mean, this is all so interconnected. And when you talk about you know, a cell that's way off in the middle of our bodies and has nothing to do with the rest of these systems, what does it matter to them? It matters everything to them. Because I don't know of a cell in our body that doesn't respond to hormones, that doesn't respond to some type of neurological input, that absolutely is under the influence of our immune system. So foundational, absolutely fundamental care that uh, makes a big impact on every cell in our body. I really appreciate you taking the time with us today, and, and it's so great to know that we don't ha all have to have medical degrees, but there are things that we can do um, to take control of our own health, and, uh, and I think LINK is one of those examples of things that we can do, do the research, find out more about it, and then experience the benefits in our own lives.